so uh, i am uh, i have just started my first corporate job as a system engineer i, I have a technical background i just completed my btech earlier this year in computer science engineering and i have been playing cricket for uh, playing competitive cricket for uh, the last decade or so in kolkata i have shifted to bangalore now for uh, my job but i had been playing cricket for more than 10 years uh, in kolkata i had also been part of my district under 16 squad and uh, so that is uh, that you can get an indication that my life has been revolving around cricket uh, for the last uh, for the major part of my life so um, as i said uh, like my uh, life had been revolving around cricket for the last decade or so and uh, i am also from a technical background so uh, i was looking for ways to merge my passion and, and profession i was uh, on the lookout for uh, courses or anything basically which uh, which helped me uh, learn more about uh, the off field stuff in cricket so that is how uh, like while searching uh, various stuff uh, including uh, i was looking for anything like it include it could have been journalism regard uh, sports journalism or uh, cricket analytics or anything so uh, in that search i stumbled upon mad about sports uh, and um, i got to uh, i got to know about the advanced cricket master class which which they were offering uh, and i went through the details of that and it uh, aligned perfectly with my uh, like with my ambition uh, i was looking exactly for something like that which could uh, help me uh, understand how how the uh, like analysis uh, and the analytics uh, uh, works uh, behind the scenes in cricket uh, so it was a perfect fit for me exactly the kind of thing i wanted and i and it was easy for me to decide to take up take up uh, on it as i said uh, while going to the uh, like advertisement of the uh, master class i was very uh, like my expectations were set very high because it aligned perfectly with with whatever what with what i was looking for uh so um uh i was also a kind, kind of a little uh, uh, afraid that uh, because uh, it looked so great from the outside uh, whether it would turn out as good uh, whether the contents would be as great uh, or not but uh, after i uh, finished the course after i was done uh, completing all the modules and everything uh, i i was more than happy it was it turned out better than my expectations um uh, it uh, provided uh, the the content included uh, uh, teaching various tools uh, required uh, for analysis which include, include python various uh, data visualization tools uh, various uh, design tools and it included um, a, a teaching where uh, teaching uh, in depth domain knowledge uh, like uh, uh, how uh, how batting analysis works how bowling analysis works how venue analysis works and uh, various in depth uh, different kinds of analysis so um, as far as the content i was really pleased and uh, it helped me learn a lot although i felt that uh, i i knew a lot about cricket uh, like beforehand uh, but even then uh, after completing the course i realized that there are there were a lot of lot more things that which i did not know which i come came to know through uh, the master class so uh, and uh, and using the skills which i learned uh, i tried to apply them and uh, it uh, it like it has paid dividends in my career so far Uh, so my breakthrough moment was uh, when uh, during the uh, just before the t20 uh, world cup last year uh, someone uh, referred me for a role with uh, cricket academy of pathan where uh, where i work with irfan pathan as a data consultant so they uh, the person who referred me they they had gone through my twitter profile where uh, where i where i had been posting a lot of uh, analysis on my own um so they they had liked my work apparently and uh, i had also been writing articles for a couple of websites so um uh, thanks to that i i got referred for the role and uh, and i got accepted in that role and since then uh, since the t20 world cup last year i have been working with him uh, as a data consultant for uh, various bilateral series and uh, and i even did and i even worked with him for uh, ipl 2022 in the t20 world cup uh, last year when i worked uh, that uh, i during the during that i was working just with uh, cricket academy of pathan uh, but uh, like by the time ipl 2022 came uh, because i had uh, had a lot of time lot more time to uh, to practice and apply my skills uh, i felt that i had gotten better by that time and uh, uh, due to that uh, i was able to uh, i i got another like during ipl 2022 i was doing two uh, 
projects simultaneously uh, one was the irfan pathan one and another one with, was with uh, stat doctor which is a project by crick access mm-hmm. where uh, where i was uh, like uh, doing a data analysis internship mm-hmm. which included um, uh, analyzing various stuff about uh, each and every game and uh, posting on their twitter handles and also writing articles around uh, like data based articles uh, around the ipl matches so uh, that was the major difference that by the time ipl 2022 came uh, i felt that i had gotten better uh, both in terms of my skills and in terms of uh, being able to manage my skills so i was able to take on two projects simultaneously my suggestion would be that uh, if anyone is interested in uh, taking up any uh, kind of role in cricket um, be it um, in any in analysis or anything any off field role in cricket or in any sport uh, and and if you feel that uh, you don't have the uh, the required technical skills i don't think that that is a huge issue because um, uh, technical skills or any kind of uh, skills can be learned but if you have a passion for the sport and if you understand the sport if you if you say if you have been following cricket uh, following indian cricket or any like international cricket for a long period of time and you discuss it with your friends and if you are able to analyze it uh, just by your own um, that should be enough for you to uh, to pursue uh, pursue the field uh, and uh, the advanced master class which mad about sports offers it is anyway designed for uh, people with zero technical experience it even teaches python from the very basic so uh, you should uh, what i feel is that you should not let your lack of technical skills uh, stop you from thinking that uh, you can also uh, like be in this industry or you can also do this thing. Uh, if you uh, like the most important thing as i as i as i said is uh, is your passion for the sport and if you have it you should go for it